In this video we're going to look at the print screen option available in RER Master. This option allows you to create customised reports. It's available for all listed records and the reports you create can be printed or exported. These reports can be available for um, all of your options available along the top here for listed information. We're going to have a look at one for an owner report just as an example. In the list here, in the field information, if you just right click and select the print screen option here, you're then brought up to show available fields on the left hand side and then currently what is listed as the selected fields on the screen behind you. In order to print this information in a report, you must have your limit of information through to 19 centimetres in width. You'll see at the moment the number or the width of centimetres for each of these fields adds up to a total of 36.8. So we do need to reduce this down to 19 centimetres. I'm going to get rid of a couple of these fields. I just want some contact information for my owner. So if I want to remove a field, I just highlight it, click on the single arrow to push it across. Again with this one I'll just remove that information there. I then need to of course limit or reduce the width of centimetres for some of these columns in order to get it down to 19 centimetres. Again you'll see even by removing a couple of fields that the total width is still more than it needs to be. So just a couple, uh, just a couple of these. In order to do that highlight the record or double click the record and then specify in centimetres the new width for that particular column. Just reduce this one down to 2 centimetres. I say OK. We now see that our width there is 2, and again our total width is starting to reduce. We'll just do that for a couple of these other ones here. Just going to adjust these ones. A couple of those ones there. You can see it's starting to drop down now to the desired amount. Last one on there that I can do, in fact, I'll remove one more of these. I don't want the fax information there remove that one out. Not quite uh, down to my desired limit there, so I can adjust a couple of these ones here. We'll just do the home phone down to two and a half and that one down to two and a half as well. Okay, so now our total width there is at the maximum of course. Anything less than that would still be suitable as well. From there, I want to preview a copy of the report, so make sure the tick remains in the preview option there, and I can print my information. That then comes up on the screen there, or report for you. From there, you can actually export that inform sorry, print that information, or alternatively, you can export this report to a couple of different formats. You'll see there, under the drop-down list, the different formats that are available to you in order to export that particular report. Looking at the information on the screen there, you may want to swap the surname and first name information around. Okay? In order to do that, close back out. If we have a look at where our information is listed there, if I highlight the surname, I just want to swap it with first name there, I can actually click on the down arrow and it will swap the order that they are in. If I go then to have a quick look at the report there, I now have my reference first name surname showing in the information there. So these reports can't be saved unfortunately, but they can be printed or saved in a different or exported to a different format. Quick and easy way of printing out information in a desired format that you require. So this video we've shown you how to print information that will suit your business needs.